Okay, today I'm going to show you how to use a different kind of quick page. This one you notice has a solid background here instead of a transparent one. So it's a little more tricky, but we can do it. So I have my quick page open and here is the photo I'm going to use. So I'm going to check the image size. Resolution is good. It's about the right size, so I'm okay with this. So control A, control C to copy, and then control V to paste. All right, there it is. Okay, we don't need that right now, so I'm going to click here on the I and hide it. And then I'm going to come down here and make a new layer. Here's my new layer. Over here, I'm going to choose a new color. I think red is nice. All right. Then up here, I'm going to choose the wand tool, the magic wand. And then make sure that your quick page is highlighted like this over here in the palette. And then using the wand, I'm going to click on the black. Up here, you can make sure this is set to contiguous. Contig and over here, the tolerance is OK at 20. All right, so the black area is selected. Then I'm going to come up here and using the paint bucket. I dye that area red. All right, good. So now let's change the opacity on this layer to about 62. Okay, doesn't matter. You just need to see through it. Now we're going to turn our image back on. So now you can see what area there is. So I'm going to highlight this, get the move tool. And I'm going to move my image so that it's in the red. It's a little short, so I'm going to do Control T, hold down Shift, make it a little bigger. OK, good. So now I'm going to go back up to layer 2, get my wand tool. So this is the red area, but I want the red area, so I'm actually going to click outside of the red area. All right, then I'm going to come down here to my image. I'm going to hit delete on the keyboard. Hide the red, and there you go. The image is in the right spot. You can see there's a little black showing behind, so I'm just going to turn this off, use my wand, get the black. Oops, see, I have the wrong layer selected. That's why I did that. So, get the black layer. All right, I'm just going to hit delete. There we go, so now it's white. So now there won't be a little black edge. Oh, I was just going to nudge this a little. Okay, there you go. All finished.